this is a public washroom and this is my handbag so when duty calls and you want to go just do it okay so i have in my bag i have always have this baby wipes you can get a sensitive one and always i just took just one um gloss you can get these gloves from anywhere or from the store so when duty calls you want to go i know so many ladies out there you just go and then uh, when you're done you take you take this toilet troll and then you try to clean yourself guess what this toilet troll doesn't really do you any good <music> For new subscribers, you're welcome back to this family. So this video talks about this holy wipes. Yeah, everything this holy wipes can do for you. Okay, so this is one of the ways, ladies, you can keep yourself clean all day, you know, without necessarily carrying with you that extra scent. You know what I mean by scent? When you went out after having a uh, number two, after going to the washroom, so the first thing we need to do is, uh, yeah, we all use tissue paper. Yeah, I, I, I agree 100% for everyone to be using the tissue paper. But you want, if you want to keep yourself clean and to be clean and cleaner all day, you need to take that extra step to do this, ladies. And the extra step that you need to take is to get this gloves, okay? This hand gloves. And uh, just wipes, baby wipes. Yeah, I hope there's no baby, there, there are no babies, you know, watching this video and uh, seeing this. They'll be laughing. Oh, yeah. But you know what? What they are laughing at is very good for us, ladies. This is very good for you. It's good for everyone. It's good for your husband. Introduce this. Introduce introduce this matter to your husband. Introduce this to your girlfriend. Introduce this to your boyfriend. Even girlfriend and boyfriend, before you go and, uh, you know, make love together. Ladies, or even guys, you need to have this with you all the time. Before you do that, you know, you go to your boyfriend's house, you've been driving all day, like a couple of hours before you get there. Yeah, our body always has this natural odor, natural fragrance that our body has. But you just want to take that extra step to clean up down there. Ladies, this is what you should have in your bag. Just bring it out, just, you know, bring it out, take one or two, and then just wipe. And then before you go make love with your uh, uh, boyfriend or before you go make love with your husband, just wipe down before making love with your husband. So this is one of the ways you can keep yourself clean all day. So now, the other ways you can keep yourself clean after having number two is for you to have this hand gloves, okay? And then uh, this baby wipes. Baby wipes, but I recommend buying um, the fragrance-free one. The fragrance-free one does not contain alcohol. The fragrance-free one is good for you. The fragrance-free one is natural, so everybody can use it. So what I do is, after having number two, I get out my hand gloves, Okay, I get out my hand gloves and make sure you get out the number of wipes without touching anything because your hands are clean. Okay, you don't want to introduce anything from here to here. No, you don't want that. So take off your take off your wipes first, which I'm doing. If you're using two, just take off the two wipes. Yeah, take off the two wipes. See, I close it. Just keep putting it back on your bag or whatever. So I have this two sitting down here. Right? So I can have this two on my hand while I just put on my gloves, okay? So I have this wipes that I'm gonna be using after using the tissue paper. So I just put on my hand gloves on my non-dominant hand when it comes to, you know, like going to the washroom. If your more non-dominant hand is your left, so just put on the gloves on your left hand. So I always go with just, not a pair, just one, one, one. 
man of this hand glove. So I just put I just put them on. Why I'm holding these two wipes on my hand, right? So I just put on my gloves, and the first thing I go for is the tissue paper. Mm -hmm. Always, always, always do wipe with the tissue paper. So the wipe with the tissue paper first, and uh, just go wipe and done in the toilet. But you want to keep yourself. You want to do that extra step to keep yourself clean all day. So because when you stop here, I just you know flush the toilet and just get up and get up like that. Ladies, there are still some particles of poo sitting right in your under underwear. I know you can agree with me. Like everyone can agree with me that you don't you don't get rid of all this stuff, the poo, right after you have number two just by using the tissue paper alone. Tissue paper alone will not keep you clean. Tissue paper alone will not give you that good hygiene that you need. All right, ladies? So just take that extra step to keep yourself clean. Trust me, you will always, always, always remember that this is the best way to keep good hygiene maintenance. So I just wipe myself with that. I don't want to go away like that. Why do you want to go away like that? Put it on your underwears and then when you go, before you get home, when you take off your underwears, it's like the whole place. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's not even talk about that. Because this has happened to me and it has happened to every, at least 80% of people watching me. Yes, take that extra step. Don't leave that pussy in your underwear waiting for the next time when you're washing. And even though you wash the underwears, some of the, the, the color, the color of whatever I see, you see how that stain on your underwear. Why did you want to do this if you can take this extra step? Okay, so the extra step that you need to do is just, okay, you already, had, or already you're done with your tissue, whatever, that everybody we normally do use, right? So the next step is, you still have this on your hand. Remember I told you, take this one off first from your, um, from the box of wipes, okay? You don't want to you don't want to clean with this and then you open this with the same gloves and then open it that's not good that's not good hygiene okay because you're introducing stuff from here to this and this is not good and then this whole thing is all contaminated then you all just contaminate this whole thing here it's just as good as throwing this away when you put your hand after cleaning your bum with the tissue paper into this um, baby wipes so this is my baby wipes that i have that i'm going to be using so yeah so you just Put it on your hand, same glove hand, and just wipe, 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 wipe. Oh, oh yeah, trying to get out of this. Yes. So I just wipe, and I have, you can, I can show it on camera now, the excess pool that was sitting there after using my tissue paper. Guys, you can't believe this. So much sitting on my box after using that tissue paper so this is the main reason and this is the most reason why you need your baby wipes with you don't tell those younger ones okay don't let the babies hear that we're using this but you know what this is good for you this is good for me and this is good for everyone so just take that extra step use these wipes okay after using it see i have it in my hand this is i just put it in my hand like this right yeah here I have it okay so how do i get rid of this and get rid of uh, the wipes that i just used to wipe my butt you know so i have this look at the way look at the way i did it ladies what you need to do is just to get put your hand because you don't want you don't want to touch with your left hand right you don't want to touch any of this because you're contaminating yourself i don't know about you for me if i don't have to touch any of that stuff i don't have to touch it so what I do is I just put my hand in see look at what I'm doing and I don't know if you can see this put your hand in and just roll 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 all you do is roll hey look at this I have all the dairy stuff inside of these gloves and guess what these are all clean these are all clean the outside ones are all clean so I just get I get rid of this uh, thing with me. How do you get rid of it? Oh, please, don't ever, ever flush this in your toilet. Because if you do, I'm going to get you. Make sure, 
make sure you put it in the bin, put it in the trash. This doesn't go into the toilet to flush. Please do not do this in a public place because that's not good. You're going to clog their toilet. You're going to clog their toilet. Okay? So if you have your trash in a house, your bin, okay, in a house and you want to get rid of this, and guess what? You don't, you don't, you don't try to trash all day. So all you may do is take the extra step. If you're at home, let me tell you how you dispose this off. If you're home, just take the extra step. Just tie. You see? I'm going to make a loop and I'm making a loop. This is it. Ladies, you can keep this in your bin for weeks and nothing smells out. On the day that you're ready to throw away the trash, you just throw them away. You don't even hear no smell. Did you want to try this hack? Did you want to try this trick? Try it and let me know. Please make sure you comment down below. So I know if this is helping you or not. Okay? So yeah, in the public place, in the public washroom, you can just take it and just throw it, throw it in the bin. If not, if you're at home, just make sure you wrap it well, put it in your uh, trash, and when it's time to get rid of the trash in the house, you can keep it for a couple of days in your house. It doesn't smell with the way I did it, with the way I loop it, and put it in the bin. And uh, yeah, so try this hack, and then let me know how you feel. Let me know how this has, this has you know, really helped you, and please leave me a comment down below. And that's it, I'm done with this video, and I hope, ladies, you watch my other videos and I will see you in my next videos. Thank you so much for watching. See you. Bye.